this there. What's going on, what's going on in this old place here? Thank you for joining us here on the live portion of the Bluegrass Tree Show right here at WJFC Studios. We're proud to have these guys with us. We've been looking forward to it for a long time. If you like good bluegrass music, you cannot beat these guys behind me. Without further ado, let me introduce to you Brookfield Drive. Thank you, Aaron. I'll tell you the best thing I ever did do. I laid off the old coat and put on the teacher, Miss Nene Carver, a uh, wonderful lady that, that really did me a lot of good back in fifth grade, and, and what she taught me is still is with me today, and I really appreciate it, I appreciate it, I hope y'all enjoy this, it's called Miss Carver's Song. Different from the folks in that. 
apologies. We have time for a couple more. Yeah, you can go ahead. Go oh, ahead. okay. Yeah, all right, fine. Yeah. I mean, we might do you. I know we are. <laughs> we might do y'all another gospel song. We worked this one up last night, and Brother Chris and Jesse. You want to do three more? Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Do three more. Okay. All right. Hope you enjoy this one. It says you don't have to move that mountain. Y'all ready? You don't have to move that mountain Just help you, Lord, to climb it You don't have to move that stumbling block Just guide me, Lord, around me We must climb a great high mountain
thank Aaron for having us today. We really appreciate this opportunity. Uh, we're going to end with a, a song that I think, from what we hear, is really needed right now. And that's Rocky Top. <laughs> so we're hoping, Brother Chris, this is Chris Blackford from White Pine, Tennessee. Uh, we're hoping that Brother Chris singing this song, Rocky Top, will help. Because it helped. We did it during sometime, I think, when we played Alabama. And we did really good. I believe it was right. I believe it was right. But anyway, so uh, he's going to do this for you. And we're just going to say, Go Balls! We're still in it. We're in it to win it, right? Right, this? <laughs> Okay. Well, uh, we have a Facebook page. It's Brookfield Drive, one word. Brookfield Drive. I can't spell it. But, uh, <laughs> I don't teach English. But anyway, uh, check us out on Facebook. Is that the best way to get hold of us? Yeah, just message my wife. I don't know nothing about it. <laughs> YouTube. Oh, we have a, a new YouTube channel that Jesse's put together. So you can type in Brookfield Drive on the YouTube. Area. Oh, well, yeah. Okay, and uh, also maybe I'm a Cobb County resident myself. Uh, you're, you're involved with the Del Rio 
Facebook and stuff over there, right? Yes, sir. Well, yes, sir. Let these people know a little bit about that. Absolutely. We do two festivals uh, each year. Now, we were a part of the, you know, what they do, like Del Rio Days, a lot of times we'll do that one. We've, we've done the, uh, the Parents Hall, we've done the, the Cock County, uh, the you know, festival. the Heritage, you know, what's it called? Street Festival. But we do also two uh, festivals to benefit the schools at Del Rio Elementary and Grassy Fork Elementary. The Del Rio Elementary is on the, the last Saturday in September, typically the fourth Saturday in September. And uh, this year we were blessed to have Authentic and Linda there, had a wonderful line up there. Uh, we were really blessed to do that, so we appreciate everybody that come out to that. But if you've not come out to that, we've done that about five years now. Uh, and the other one is in the spring. Uh, we usually do it the, the weekend before Mother's Day weekend, not the weekend of Mother's Day, but the weekend before Mother's Day weekend. So a lot of times it falls at the very first weekend in May. And it's the Grassy Fork Bluegrass Gym, and we've done it for 10 years. And uh, this year we are 11th, Lord willing, and we, it benefits the kids at, at Grassy Fork. Yeah, I've also, I, I went to the Del Rio one myself, uh, folks, you need to go out there. It's a real nice place. They built a new stage up there. They, they've got it fixed up nice. Got good bands down there. I had a ball with me and my family went. And uh, I advise you and your family to go. And you'll have a great time. And it's a wonderful place. And we'll be keeping you up to date here on the Bluegrass Crew when that comes up this year. I let you know in advance. And uh, we try to help any way we can, especially this local event, you know. Yes, sir. And, but guys, we really appreciate you coming. Yes, sir. Really yes, sir. Thank you so much. And without uh, one more thing, without good sponsors, why well, we couldn't be doing this right now. And uh, so I'm gonna give a shout out real quick before we go back on the radio or the Bobcat there. Uh, I'm gonna give a shout out to Callaway's Auto Sales in Jefferson City. Uh, Big John Callaway, you need vehicle, go out there and see John. And also uh, Cider Real Music Store Music Barn down in Clinton, Tennessee. And uh, tonight. 7 to 10 o'clock, folks. Uh, Donnie and Patty West and the band's going to be down there. Uh, admission is $10. Uh, kids 12 and under are free. So if you like good old classic country music, well, get down there, take your family, and go down there and check in guys out. It's a real cool place. They've got cattle locker shirts at every instant that you can imagine. And uh, I went down there last week and checked them out. So. But go down there tonight, take your family, save my old friend Michael Green that's running it down there. Folks, we're glad you've been with us. Be sure to tune in with us next week. We're going to have some good old-fashioned gospel music next week uh, with the staff family. And we look forward to that. Good day and God bless you. We'll Christ Christ. Did you an instrument? Did you an instrument?